Hello everybody, and this is Tiffany. Um, I know I haven't made a video in a long time, but this video I just wanted to share my collection. Um, my updates. Um, before I had all my polishes in a white, like, little drawer box. So they were all just thrown in there. Well, I finally came up. Well, I wouldn't say came up because I bought these beautiful wall racks see before not knowing anything about them when I grew out my nails I started getting into nails um, I thought you could just go to um, Sally's Beauty um, Supply or any store and purchase nail polish racks not knowing that they're very hard to find so for a while I was thinking gosh should I build mine because on YouTube a lot of people were building their own so I was thinking, should I just build it? But who am I kidding? I'm not a crafter. <laughs> but anyways, um, after asking a lot of people, they said my choice is whether it's eBay or Amazon. Neither both, I knew about eBay and Amazon, but never purchased stuff from them. And then everybody told me if I should pick one, I should go through Amazon. So I, I went through Amazon and I came across these. And these have the Pana beautiful like the, it came out to 30 something for one um if they the polish will on there you'll be able to see it has a heart background see from the lines it's a heart and it goes down like that you won't see because of the orally and then it goes back up very beautiful um and i'm getting two so which is came out to 60 something but i think it was well worth it for a very long time I've been wanting one of these, and I got two. Um, so yeah, it was well, very well worth it, very beautiful. Um, I also got these from Amazon. 18 polishes, well, including the clear and hardener. It includes the clear and hardener, but you get 18 for 15 something. I'm not sure about the direct um, payment of it but very beautiful I'm very addicted to glitter so I had when it bought me a glitter set um, <clears throat> as you can see I also when I got these every girl needs these to hold your nail polishes so you get two of them I think two something. Then I got these for a dollar. Well, this for a dollar something. I have yet to use it. So, yeah. Okay, well. I love glitter. I'm about to show you each of them individual and name them. This is called Born to the Purple. I haven't used it yet. This one's called Green with NB. This one's a very pretty color. It's called Blue Eyed Girl. The only way I could describe this color when I'm um, you put it on is like looking into a deep blue ocean with gems in it that's how it really looks it's a very very pretty color it's one of the first ones I use this one it's called blackout this is the one I have on right here it's a very pretty color all of them are pretty colors This one's red hot. I tell you, since buying these stuff off Amazon, I have came very, became very addictive to Amazon. That is now officially my go-to place. This one's called Tutu Tangle. Tango. 
Jason's um, very pretty out there color. This one's called Mixed Signals. Very pretty. I think before looking, this one's called Pinky Moon. Also very cute. I have yet to use this, but I know it's going to be a cute color. Yep, pinky moon. And this one. I haven't tried this either. This one's called Golden Urbana. And a lot of people, um, this collection is clean color. And I've heard a lot of people say they don't like clean color for the fact that it chips too fast. Um, and a little bit about the show me nails I've had for a couple of weeks. I, I've had them on. And this is uh, yeah. Go Bunny. And for me, I like clean color because it does, it does not chip on me very fast. I have yet to see it chip. <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, of course, at the end of your nails, which is like this. Like, the ends are here. You're going to chip because, you know, that's... I'm always tapping my nails, so that's expected. This is Golden Caviar. Very, another very pretty color. This is Taking Hat. I just love glitters. And this one's sugar coat. And these are the are included with your purchase, which is the clear coat. And then the nail hardener. This comes with it. Um, it may look like I used a lot of this, but what it was when I did purchase it, the lid was open a bit, so some did leak out, but it was no problem. That was fine. But yes, that comes with your purchase, and it's 15 something, which is well worth it. Yeah, and this is called Chunky Silver. It's gonna put it Chunky. Chucky, <laughs> chunky little glitters. <coughs> this one, I love this. I love so um glitter like this. It's called bridal shower. I've used this, and then this is. Let's see if you can see the stars in it. Yeah, you can see the stars. And this is called Silver Star. Very pretty color. And these are my nails. The two colors I used on my nails were um, Bridal Shower and Blackout. This is the Bridal Shower. And this is the Blackout. Very, very pretty colors. <coughs> and of course, my oils. I got my almond oil, vitamin E, shea oil, tea tree oil, and then I had to go get me two more bottles of vitamin E and almond because I love them. I have way more oils, but they just couldn't fit on here. They were too big. As you can see, see how these are all in there? You just had to sit on top. This one is the regular Sally Beauty Supply cuticle oil, but I did add um, grapeseed oil, olive oil, um, tea tree oil, and yeah, this is my Mongo, my remover. I have another big pink remover, but like I said, they couldn't fit. These are just my little other, this is my oil. I, 
constantly having to put oil. This is contains um I make my own oil even though I have critical oil and stuff. This has almond oil, vitamin E oil, and kid um critical oil of course. Um coconut oil which I also have. The ones that are not in this picture have olive oil, grapeseed oil. The grapeseed oil also has avocado oil and then the coconut oil. These are the polishes I had for a couple years. I've had all these for a couple of years already. <clears throat> these I had probably for a couple months. These right here for a couple months. This is a ridge filler. Hmm, this don't work. Really at all, it's called super dry and you're supposed to wait for a couple seconds and put it on on your wet nail polishes, but it just leaves mine even wetter and takes longer to dry. Nail magic. I have to get more of this. This is yellow stopper. I just love the vibrant purple color of these on your nails. These are the little ones. The little knickknacks. My nail brush, which I packed for years in this tail. This little mini stuff. Fresh, which I also have that one in here. And this is little stickers. I don't know. I really, this one has glitter, but you can't tell. I don't know, I try to use these. I don't know if I'm doing them wrong or just don't go with me. But, um, they just come right off basically when you wash your hands and then this. A little fighter that comes with them. It's pretty cute. But yes, I just wanted to show you my wall rack and the bins for the panda. It's a very beautiful. I wish I would have showed you guys without the polishes. Um, maybe I have pictures I could put a collage together and upload it to show you how they look. But it's a heart background. I got them for Amazon for both of them. Uh, 60 something but well worth it again these are from amazon right here clean color 15 something plus free shipping it's pretty awesome it was well worth it i love it but yeah i just wanted to show you my little collection and my nail polish wall racks i mean if you have any questions just comment about where i got them or you know, like, specifically or whatever. But if not, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this. I'm getting there. My my goal is to have a whole wall full of these. <laughs> okay, guys, well, I hope you have a good day, and um, I hope you liked my little collection. Bye.